We need to be talking about the chest mimic enchant because there could potentially be a new enchant be put in the game that could replace it forever. As well as that, we got a whole bunch of new leaks finally for update 9 that is coming out Saturday morning. So we should definitely be talking about this. In this video, I'm going to be talking about all of those leaks that we got so far and basically how you should be investing before this update. Remember to like and subscribe if this video helps you out. We do a lot of Pet Simulator. 99 investing stuff on this channel so if that stuff interests you you should definitely be joined up let's get right into it though because we've been waiting on some leaks for this update for quite a while okay you guys so as you guys know big games likes to give a lot of leaks about upcoming updates that are about to happen in the game but for some reason this update we did not get basically any leaks from big games themselves about the update and then finally yesterday we were just given some actual leaks about about the new exclusive enchants as well as the exclusive pets that are going to be coming in the potential exclusive egg. So first of all, I'm going to have the only leak that we've actually gotten from Big Games themselves on the screen here. So basically, Big Games has posted this picture with the caption saying that the world is going to end in three days. So this is basically just a sneak peek into a lot of the new pets that we are going to be getting in this new update. Now we are pretty certain that some of these pets are the new exclusive pets, but these are the only pictures that we have gotten from big games themselves. And then I'm going to have this tweet on the screen here, which is another kind of leak, I guess, which is basically just big games letting us know that they're going to be focusing on performance basically uh for this update because they tweeted this out i doubt there's going to be actually that much content in this update because they felt the need to say that the focus of this update was just to get all the performance bugs out of the game now if they are able to actually get a lot of the bugs out of the game and a lot of the errors that most players are getting it would actually solve a lot of issues so i think this is a good thing but in order for this to be actually sufficient for an update they would actually need to get rid of most of these bugs that we got and we do have a lot of issues in the game so i'm not sure if they are going to be able to actually get rid of most of the issues that we do have and if we don't end up getting a lot of content it would be very disappointing of an update if a lot of the same bugs were still in the game but from other tweets from the devs it does seem like they are working on a lot of performance issues so I am pretty optimistic about these changes at least. Now on the screen here is a picture of the new surge machine that we are going to be getting in this new update. Now personally I don't really know what this is going to do. I would assume this is kind of like the pet surge ultimate. Now let me know in the comment section down below what you think this machine does because there is a lot of speculation going on and honestly I'm not really sure what I think this one's going to do. Big Games really likes to surprise us with these machines so I'm not even going to speculate. We're going to have to wait and see till saturday now next up in leaks we have this nightmare ultimate now i have been seeing a couple people saying that the name of it in the files is the nightmare token so it actually might not be an ultimate but if you do compare it to what the ultimates look like they are pretty much identical so i would assume this is an ultimate and whatever name they actually gave it in the files is incorrect while this ultimate might be cool and it might look cool it probably is just going to be another little crappy damage ultimate that is added to the game sort of like the tsunami or the black hole basically any of the ultimates that actually do inflict damage are just not that good right now with the current meta of the game because most people are able to farm the areas pretty fast and don't need any sort of damage buff so these ultimates usually end up being pretty useless for most people but we will have to wait and see what this one does maybe it will surprise us and actually be kind of decent and besides that it does seem like we are going to be getting a new exclusive egg in this update i couldn't find any leaks about the actual exclusives that are going to be in the egg but these are the pictures of the titanic and then basically the two huges that are going to be in the egg so it does look like this egg is going to be called the force field egg or something around that name 
because all of these three pets have the name force field in it so so that's what we can assume and then we can probably also expect that the sketch eggs are going to go up quite a bit in price they've already jumped pretty significantly in price from these leaks that we got yesterday the sketch eggs are now sitting at 31.1 million but of course with how big inflation has been lately we can expect the price of the sketch egg to reach at least the price of the superhero egg which is currently sitting at 38.6 million so buying these would be a pretty good investment right about now because we can expect that the sketch eggs will reach the same values as the jelly eggs the superhero eggs even the emoji eggs like all, all of these recent eggs usually end up being the same price after a couple weeks of the update being out so once these are out of the exclusive shop it is almost guaranteed that these are going to go up in value so personally i think these are a very good investment now let's get on to the juicy exclusive enchants that we did get leaked and it looks like we've only gotten two of these enchants leaked so that could have a lot of implications on how you should be investing your diamonds so the first one I'm going to have on the screen here is called the Supercharged Enchant. And because of that name, I would assume that the Supercharged Enchant would do something similar to the Pet Surge Ultimate. Now, obviously, I'm not 100% sure about this, but the name Supercharged Enchant really gives me the vibes of the Pet Surge Ultimate. My thoughts are that it's going to be some sort of like upgraded speed enchant, which actually isn't that bad. I made a video a long time ago about how the Speed 5 Enchant is actually good for some people. So if they do make an enchant that actually increases your damage and increases the speed of your pets, that would actually be a pretty decent enchant. So we're going to have to wait and see if this supercharged enchant is actually something like that. This is another thing you should let me know in the comments what you think it does. Because big games tends to be pretty creative in the way they think about these enchants. And honestly, half the time I am wrong. So, But I'll have the next leaked enchant up on the screen here. And this is probably the more interesting one. As the name of it is the mini chess hunter enchant. And this exclusive enchant could have a huge impact on the economy. Because as you guys know, the most expensive enchant that we currently have in the game is the chest mimic. And basically what the chest mimic does is gives you a chance to spawn a mini chest when you destroy a breakable. And this mini chest hunter enchant sounds like it would do something similar. Now everybody in the community is debating on what this enchant could possibly do. There's a lot of people saying that this enchant could possibly work with the chest mimic enchant and possibly give you better loot from mini chests. Now, if we do look at other exclusive enchants that we have gotten, there are two exclusive enchants that have the name Hunter in them, and those are going to be the Super Shiny Hunter as well as the Huge Hunter. Now, both of these enchants do increase the odds of whatever their respective enchant is. So the Huge Hunter increases the odds to get Huges, and obviously the Shiny Hunter increases the odds of getting Shinies. So if we do have an enchant that is called the Mini Chess Hunter, we could probably probably expect that it's going to increase the chances of getting mini chests because that's what the other two enchants with the name hunter in them do now the reason that this could be pretty controversial is because they were talking about a while back bringing the chest mimic back into the game and then there was some pretty upset people in the community talking about how that negates the whole purpose of these enchants being exclusive anyways so if this new exclusive enchant does turn out to be as good or even better than the chest mimic enchant the price of this enchant would probably plummet as there would be an alternative that would be a whole lot cheaper but obviously this enchant could do anything it could turn out to be just as bad as the other newer enchants that we've gotten recently so we will have to wait and see but i would imagine that the news of this enchant coming out could possibly lower the price of the chest mimic and i do think that the chest mimic enchant is still so rare that the price of these things would never really fall that low because there isn't that many of these things in circulation and personally i don't think they would put out an enchant that is better than the chest mimic because the chest mimic is already still the best enchant that we have in the game but if it does end up making people spend robux on the game i don't see why big games wouldn't put in a new enchant that does exactly what the chest mimic does if you guys did notice that was only two leaked enchants that we got and we currently have three exclusive enchants in the store that say last chance on them so we can only assume that one of these three last chance enchants are going to be staying in the exclusive shop 
for the time being. Now, obviously, the boss chest mimic has been in the exclusive shop for three updates now compared to these two only being in the exclusive shop for two updates. So we can assume one of those options is going to be the boss chest mimic leaving the shop. And the price of this thing has been skyrocketing since the news of this exclusive enchants coming out. So people are fairly confident that this one will leave the exclusive shop. Now, in terms of the other two, I would imagine that the boss lucky block would be leaving the exclusive shop and not the super magnet enchant just because I feel like there actually is a ton of people that are buying the super magnet enchant and not a lot of people buying this boss lucky block just because it isn't that good of an enchant. But obviously we are gonna have to wait and see. I don't know what big games is gonna do. Maybe they just remove all three and they only add those two new enchants into the exclusive shop. That is completely possible, but I did feel like it's important to mention that they could possibly leave the Super Magnet Enchant in the exclusive shop, which would cause the prices of this enchant to actually plummet after the update comes out. But again, we're going to have to wait and see on that. Let me know in the comments section down below what you think all of these leaks mean. Hopefully we get some more leaks coming from big games themselves because I like to usually only cover those leaks, but because we haven't gotten many leaks from them, I had to cover these other ones this week. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll catch you in the next one. Peace out.